Look how beautiful mommy Mom is. Mom looks amazing. Is that allowed? <laughs> What's up you guys? I cannot believe that Iz and I have been married for five years. Cinco so babe, años. how are we celebrating? Well, uh, we're gonna celebrate in a lot of ways that we cannot show on television, <laughs> but we are going to today watch our wedding video for, for the, the first, first time. time. And we are not upset with each other at all. So we're, we're just curious. It's five years in, we decided we're gonna watch it and you get to watch us watch it. Here we go. Okay, now I know that I previously said I didn't wanna watch our wedding video until we're like, angry with each other or a reason to need to revisit why we got married in the first place. No, now I'm just curious. Now I'm just like five years in. Let's sit on the couch and watch this video. Every year our anniversary rolls around. We're like, should we watch the video? We're like, nah, maybe next year. Yeah, we maybe just don't feel year. like, I feel like it was just yesterday, but I don't, okay. We're gonna watch a shortened version of it. We are going on a vacation. And Iz and I were sitting to an undisclosed uh, location. <laughs> and we are going to sit and actually watch the full hour of this video. But I feel like, you know, so that we don't completely lose our minds and ball our eyes out, that we'd get a little, a little preview of what that I would like be this. like here. Do you feel that? I think okay. all things Adrian viewers will appreciate this. Okay, and what are you expecting to watch in this video? What are you hoping to see? I'm hoping to be inspired I'm to get back to that. Yeah, I'm expecting to see myself like 18 pounds lighter. Same. And well, I like am 22 hoping, for me. I'm hoping that I actually look exactly the same. But you asked what I'm expecting and what I'm hoping. Those are two different things. I am hoping to be inspired to fit back into that dress once again. That's crazy. I fit back into it at three years. Can I do it again at five? But what I'm really hoping to see is the stuff that I never got to see. Like I think sometimes you're in just such mm -hmm. a whirlwind on that day that there's so many little details that you forget or never actually got to notice. So I'm curious to see like other like other people's perspective on that day. Did you just say whirlwind? Oh, yeah. Oh no, a whirlwind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, whirlwind. W. -H. I just wanted to make sure. I R L W I N D. Whirlwind. There was so much tequila. <laughs> so lying. we don't remember anything. He's lying. I actually didn't drink at all at my wedding. Um, the whole time Ray kept trying to get me to have champagne. I'm like, no, no. I want to be crystal clear and I want to remember every single thing. The only time I drank was when it was time for us to go up to our honeymoon suite at the very, very end. What time was like almost two o'clock, three o'clock in the morning. And I had two shots of tequila to stay awake. And I'm grateful for that for the awake part. Whoop. Um she was alive. So, I'm I'm I think I think what I'm looking most forward to seeing is like the reactions and the responses of people like right? who were experiencing things from their perspective that we didn't Same. see. Cuz my angle was just on you. <laughs> I just stared at your Ooh. face the whole time. And I'm just curious to see like what was happening in the surroundings. You know what? Because we, I didn't pay attention to anyone else on that right. day but you. We were given great advice. Couple things. We were given the advice, hold hands the entire time. Which we did. So we we stayed attached yeah. the whole time. So it was never like he was pulled to one side of the ballroom mm -hmm. and I was on the other side. We walked around together and did and everything event. together. We were also told eat before. So when we went to go take Thank our pictures. God. I had arranged in the... Rolls Royce. Oh yeah, the Rolls Royce. Mm -hmm. I'm, I did it good, right? He surprised me with a beautiful pearl Rolls Royce. From like 1964 or something? Yeah. yeah. And um, in it I had the... French fries and a croque monsieur. Yeah, very good. It was amazing and we sat in the back of the car and we ate and thank God. Because, because although Alain Ducasse was our chef, chef for our wedding, we never eat the food. I can't tell you. I what think I had a bite or two. Wildly like expensive meal. Yeah. Um, tasted like, have no clue. Okay, I'm it excited. is time to watch. Put your ear in. Ooh, look at you. Okay, tattoo. we're ready. I know five years. It five years in. I now have a tattoo with your name on it. Mm -hmm. You have a huge tattoo with my name on it. One year in. 
You're welcome. He got his one year in. I did mine five. Hers is this big. Mine is this big all the way around my arm, so. I kept it dainty, people. Okay. I kept it dangerous. <laughs> That's actually really cute. Okay, all right, it's happening. I saw the opening and it has um, our wedding crest uh -huh. that we created. And I realized we have not used that or seen it in so long. In we five had years. slippers made with it mm -hmm. for our guests that with their feet were hurting while they were dancing, they put that on. What else? It was on everything. It was on the invitation. We used the wedding crest for everything and now we're we considering have champagne glasses. putting the crest on our gates at our house in New York. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. From the minute I met Israel, there was interviews? a genuine love. He adores my sister. There was interviews? He loves her in such a special way. He used to tell me I want somebody like Papa Lou because he loved me so much and you wanted somebody like him, even with the dimples. <laughs> I know he will make you happy, like Louis make you happy. Oh, Pray that's God so that, beautiful. Uh, in the midst of God of arguments or anything that may happen, that happens in marriage, I said I wasn't going to cry. Your love, oh God, you had your whole squad. That the love that they have for each other, Lord, will always surpass any difficulty, Lord. We thank you, Lord, and I thank you, Father, for allowing us to take part. Okay, in I think this I do need tissue. Jesus you got some right there. That was quick. Wow. I'm ready. My heart is ready. I never saw you before. Just, I've actually. You look like a little never boy. Been more clear and more sure about a thing. I've never felt a sense of purpose and blessing and grace for this journey ever. So like you would tell me, breathe, take in every moment. This is the beginning of the rest of our lives. Where are those letters? You're my first and you Your mom has them only. So today I give you I need to get, I need to keep those at the house, no? I am, the good and the bad. I give you the rest of my life. Oh my God, this is amazing. You never seen none of this? Never. Oh, Woo. you didn't see me getting ready? This is before or after they found the veil? Before. Before my veil went missing. The little choir! Remember the little boys choir? The little boys! Guys, we had a boys choir that's Oh Bowie! I never got to see <laughs> Bowie because she fell asleep. God, I'm she tiny. Did, she didn't make it. Right, I remember this perfectly. I never got Oh my god, I Look never got Jet to see Jet! Jet. I never Oh my gosh! Just like and here's some for you. And, and here's, here's some, some for, for you. you. I never got to see your reaction to me walking out because that oh was my the God, reaction. You were almost crying. I thought you weren't gonna cry. Babe. And from oh from being so gosh. far away, I thought you weren't crying. Do you know how hard it was to walk in that? We're going to ask God's blessing upon us today because for those of us who believe, we believe that when we gather in his yes. name, or whatever the purpose may be, Lucia, Ravon, Tina. And so we're going to ask you to join with us in just a moment of prayer. You know this is I'm amazing. Silly. That's why I like you. Boy, are you ever silly. I never met anybody sillier than me. I was like, I met so you. focused on you. I like you because you know when it's time this to This is our easily. book, babe. I like you. Maybe day after tomorrow. Maybe Gosh, never. why am I so Too late for tomorrow. Silly. And uh, I'm going to ask you, Israel, if you will, first of all, present your personal vows before we move on to the formal vows. If you'll oh, present gosh. your personal vows to Adrian. Oh, my gosh. Why did I turn to you like I was scared of you? Yours were so much better. What do you mean? You're so much better. You're the writer. I'm a terrible writer. I wish. I wish. 
to see my love, my love tonight, tonight. You taught me that when you see 1111, you should make a wish. And it's always been so cool and romantic and special and so us to make that wish. And it's breathtaking how often we see that number. So many signs. However, this is so My breasts far look huge. Beyond Why am I breathing like that? Did you see that? Or a sign. This is <laughs> so real. gorgeous, babe. This is real life. Real love, real risk, and real reward. You just don't believe it. I've said it before, yet it bears repeating. You embody what grace actually looks like to me. You are that tangible grace to me. Oh, babe, that's beautiful. I wish, I wish to be, to be with you, with you forever. Forever. And ever. Okay. Israel. When I met you, I truly had no idea how much my life would change years later. But then, how could I have known a love like ours only happens once in a lifetime? When you came into my life, I realized that what I had always thought was happiness could not compare to the joy loving you brought me. Israel, I love loving you. When I fell in love with you, I fell in love with all of you. This is so weird. I didn't just fall in love with the best of you, like how your smile lights up a room, the way your laugh makes my heart smile, the way your hand fits perfectly with mine. And today, I vow to always love you this way, <laughs> always, unconditionally, to respect you, even when I disagree with you, to respect the decisions you make for our family. I literally had to start doing that when my knees up, those and pass out. Say bye, what do you mean? Night. You know when you lock your knees too long and you like hold your breath, you could like pass out. But to leap outside of my comfort zone. Who dropped something? <laughs> I vow to communicate with you. Is that Lucia? And not shut down. Who is that? Oh, a microphone, right? <laughs> I think it was a microphone. <laughs> I'm a text today. Lou, did you drop did your you mic? Did you drop your mic at our wedding in the most important part of it? I choose you for life. You are so worth it. And the Lord shall open up unto you his good treasure. And thou shalt not go aside from thou the Lord which I command you this day, to the right hand or to the left, or go after other gods to serve them. And everyone that agrees with that blessing, please say amen. Amen. Israel, you may kiss the bride. That was a good kiss. That was a good kiss. Well, damn. Oh, we were kissing for that long? Absolutely. Is that allowed? I didn't realize we kissed her that long. Yes. So this is not the real coloring of the room. The real coloring was that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the real coloring of what, the real videos were way brighter for daytime television. Okay, this is, he surprised me. With, this is great. This this is fantastic. I love all this part. We had to go get the Now that the I'm not in the taken. vulnerable emo part of the video, I can breathe easy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It is. We look like doing the so long. So far, the takeaway is. Bottom. Who was that person that um? Mr. and Mrs. Israel. Do you know she introduced us? Come for the inch to come in. I never knew that. I never knew she was the person. Lonnie introduced us to the reception. You didn't tuck your shirt in. That's the <laughs> that's the vest. No, the white. Your white shirt. The vest shirt. is white. Uh oh.
Dang, I look cute there. I just want to wish the very best to you. Look how beautiful Always mommy is. Mom looks Why amazing. That's the most important thing. If you can always Bop be with his own that, camera. I think it will <laughs> of course. All the memories and everything come back into perspective. Love you guys and wish you the very best. Your mom is gorgeous. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your attention. I hate to drag you away from all these beautiful Do you people. Remember but this? Please listen to this ugly guy. For Do you remember his second. speech? Israel, Adrian, for the first time. That smile on my face. <laughs> Do I look stuck? I've never seen you this happy. I've never seen you more scatterbrained. <laughs> I've never had to pick up more things behind you because you forgot them. And I'm so happy to do that because I know you're aimed at something that just makes you happy. And I've known him longer than everybody in this room. And I'm not going to shame him by saying anything that's off color. I love off you so color? much. I'm so happy for you. That's where you get those kind of things from. <laughs> I love Chris. Thank you for bringing a different color into our family. Israel has the best black, brothers. And now we are <laughs> yeah. That's great. When Adrian first asked me to be her maid of honor, that Bobby, light on Claude. I was like, duh, I'm your only sister. Duh. <laughs> and she kind of adores me. I do, me. I do. Okay. Um, but serious, <laughs> but seriously, I felt so happy and honored. So weird how life changes, right? Right. Kept reminding me that I have to make this. Speech. Right. Being the shy one, I absolutely hate talking in front of people. And then I was like, oh my God, I'm literally this is so weird. people who do this kind of thing for a living. <laughs> and I was spe specifically thinking about you, Angie. <laughs> Not to mention the Emmy nominated ladies of The Real. <laughs> I secretly started daydreaming of ways to get out of it, but that obviously didn't work out. And so here I am. Aww. So then Papi sang Es Mi Niña Bonita. What we're missing in this video is the New York is moment is the New York moment when the pizza came out, but yes. most importantly, when Georgie and Mirtha danced. <laughs> I've had the time of my life. And Dirty Georgie dancing dropped, dropped Mirtha, Mirtha onto the ground. Onto the ground, she fell Full on the floor. On. Imagine like and you're trying to do like a dip and someone just drops you on the floor. And so I don't think she on. felt a thing. I don't think so either. Yeah. Not even sure she remembers it. Correct. Okay, so I started saying this during the video. The coloring on here is interesting because it's not at all how I remember it, but it's because of the camera lens that they were using specifically for the reel. Mm -hmm. It was intended to brighten the whole room. Yeah. The reality is both my like ceremony and, and my reception were like all candlelit, like really dark. Like so dark that they had to film it differently or else you wouldn't have been able to see. Like I wanted to have a night wedding that was like very sexy, very moody, a whole vibe. <laughs> and I did that in this video does not reflect that. You picked that, yeah. Right. Okay, why did the part about Uncle Louie, that was like, yeah. I didn't know that they did interviews with my family, so that's kind of wild. Um, Titi Fuji is my mother's sister, and she is my godmother, and she was married to my Uncle Louie, who I loved very, very much, and he actually passed away from cancer, and I really did always tell my aunt that I would have loved to marry someone like him, and I always said I wanted to marry someone with huge dimples, which my Uncle Louie had, and I did. Boom. You also wanted to marry a bad driver, which you did. I did. Here's what I want to say, like, I feel like I know you so much more now. I'm, like, in some ways, it's like us watching somebody else's wedding. I know that sounds, Wait, I know that sounds crazy. No, I just, so much has happened in five years and the way we've grown in that five years and what we know about each other now. Yeah. Even though we knew a lot about each other then. But, but it's like, just different. Yeah. To have lived it out and walked it out. It's like, wow, I mean, that's a, that's a cool looking couple and a beautiful couple and nice people, but like, we know who they really are and that makes it even better. Does that make sense? Yeah. I'm offended you didn't really cry, like fully cry. I I, expected I had to hold it cry. back. I almost cried at how cringy I feel watching myself be so vulnerable. I hated that You're moment. a thug, that's what you're saying? No, I just hated that moment. Like, I loved you so much because like there's a lot to watch. Your God will be my God. <laughs> Shut up. That was some, what are you talking about? That was awesome. Don't Your people shall be my Shut people. Up. Your enemies will be my mortal enemies for life. For real, don't play with my husband. Your I grudges will, will be my grudges. That's Forever. actually 
That's the one thing I did learn about her is I don't hold grudges very well nope. at all. I, I tend to forgive for people you. and let them off the hook. Mm -hmm. She does not. So Somebody, if you've ever done me wrong, I can't stand. We're you. probably cool, but we not you friends. you are not cool. We are not friends, and probably never will be. We're never. working on that. So. Never. Well, God bless you guys. Thank you so much for <laughs> joining us for <laughs> our five-year anniversary. Um, thank you for your blessings. Don't forget to subscribe. We love you guys, and happy anniversary, baby. Mm.